all welcome to force galaxy hope you are doing good okay so today in this video we'll going to discuss the scenario okay so scenario is not much complex okay here the thing is you just have to think about which context variable you will going to use and which event you will going to use to perform this scenario okay so the scenario is like this uh, you have to avoid the undeletion of record that is the records which are already deleted you have to avoid them to restore back again okay so here like suppose account is the object and from this account i have deleted one of the record okay now this record is now available in the recycle bin correct now when a user goes to this recycle bin from there the user should not be able to undelete this or should not be able to restore this back to the account object okay so we have to perform this on our account okay for only the account records we have to avoid the undeletion okay so the complex is not uh, so the scenario is not complex only the one line of code we need to perform the thing is which event and the on which context variable you will going to perform this okay so now let's move to the solution so here the first thing is which event you will going to use okay so our event in this case will be the after and delete you must have heard about this after and delete but this is rarely used okay so the after and delete is our event okay and in this if you remember we have value in the two context variable one is trigger dot new and the another is trigger dot new map okay so in this case in this after and delete we have the id because our record is already there in the salesforce but it is deleted and present in the recycle bin okay so the id is there this is because we are having value in context variable trigger dot new map okay so next move to the condition here so this is my condition if my trigger is after and trigger is undelete then we'll going to call our function avoid undeletion okay so here currently i just require the list of the records which the user will going to undelete okay it can be a single or it can be a multiple okay so currently there is no i did not require new map in my requirement i can manage with this trigger dot new only okay now next move to the handler okay so here is the handler and this is my method avoid and deletion so as we want to un avoid the undeletion of account object record so here the list of account will be added and this is my new list of account okay so now first we will going to check whether this list has a value or not if yes then it will going to move to the for loop okay so here in this for loop we'll going to iterate over this new list and if there is a single record or multiple record for each record the trigger will going to show an error you cannot and delete the deleted account records okay so this add error is a function using which we are able to show an error over the ui okay so whenever a user will try to undelete the record of account from the recycle bin this method will be called and that record will be passed here in this trigger dot new okay in my method we're going to get the value in this new list and now next we'll going to iterate over this new list so the whatever the record is there it will come into this instance okay and this and on this we are adding this function add error and my trigger will going to show an error as soon as user will try to restore the record okay so now let's move to the ui so here is my account okay let's just try to delete this record here okay then we'll try to re restore it from the recycle bin okay just delete this okay it is deleted now let's refresh my recycle bin so here is the record which we recently deleted okay now let's try to undelete this okay restore is the option okay as soon as i try to click on this my trigger should fire and as per my requirement it should show me an error that you cannot undelete this okay
So here, as you can see, it has shown me the message, whatever we have passed here in this add error function, okay? You cannot undelete this. This is the account object, okay? Now let's, if I try to undelete this contact object record, it has undeleted, okay? So in this case of account, my trigger will going to fire and for all the object which we will going to undelete, it will going to show me an error, okay? You cannot undelete them, okay? If I hide this method, so now my trigger will not going to call this function and my account recall will get deleted, okay? Oh, sorry, will get restored. It is restored and it is now available here in this account object, okay? It is available here back in this object, okay? So here in this scenario, the main thing is which event you will going to select, okay? And on what context variable you will going to use this add error function, okay? So here after undelete will going to act similar to the after insert, okay? In this case also, we are inserting our record back to the Salesforce object, okay? Only the difference is in, in this after undelete, we are just, we are again inserting the record, but from the inside the Salesforce only from recycle bin, okay? So it will again going to act as insertion on the account object, okay? So that is why we are having the value in context variable similar to the after insert, okay? So hope this scenario is clear to all. And if you still have any issues or any query related to this, do let me know in the comment section. We'll be happy to help you out. Thank you.